This video is sponsored by Dubby Jitterless Energy Blend. Click on the link in the description and use the code PACKERMAN to save 10% on any order. What's happening ladies and germs, this is the Packer Man, and welcome to today's edition of Flea Market Hunter, episode number 63. And today is a special edition because this is the 2022 Memorial Day weekend hunt. Meaning that this hunt in particular, this episode in particular, will focus on the three days, yes three, this time around, that I spent hunting at the flea market because there was a special Monday edition as well because it was Memorial Day weekend. <laughs> they usually do that for Memorial Day and for Labor Day. So, you get three whole days of hunting in this one episode. So, I'd advise getting some popcorn, maybe a cool drink, and settle in because this is going to be one hell of a hunt. I feel like a zombie right now. Oh, Lord. Yeah, getting up early is not usually one of my favorite things to do. Unless it's going to the flea market and finding some video games, which... As you can see, I've stumbled upon a couple of stacks here. Let's see what we can find in this stack, shall we? Yeah, it's actually a bit chilly this morning. I know, my son there freezing. 30. Yeah, they're uh, exclusive, a Target exclusive. They're $100. They're regular. Of course, probably won't be saying it's chilly in a couple of hours. Yeah. <laughs> it's supposed, I think it's supposed to get up in the 90s today. Oh, it's crazy. Do you so much? Dollar. What you want for that? Five bucks. I'm trying to remember if I have this one or not. I have so many freaking Wii games, it's not even funny. Uh, you got change for 20 Got some Xbox one games here, but that monster hunter world has certainly caught my eye Warm. Hey, how are you guys? Right. Much was you asking on your Xbox one game? Five. Five. Depending on what games they are, five bucks is actually not bad. Is it just me, or does it seem like pop figures are showing up more and more at the flea market now? Yeah. Uh, yeah. 
Huh, that's interesting. A Resident Evil 5 Steelbook Edition. Don't really see those too often. Ooh, hello. Castlevania Lords of Shadow 2 on the Xbox 360. And it's sealed. It's Pikachu! <laughs> Looks like there's a set of Metal Gear Solid games here. Those are sold as a set. Brand new. Not scratch on any of those discs. How much was you asking? I'm asking 75 on the set. Mm. 75 is just way too much for my taste. What about on the controller? Controller, it's tested, it doesn't work. I was asking five. Mm. That is a big ass sword. Let's ruffle through Dave's stuff a little bit here. 
And he's got quite a few games, it looks like, here today. Summer Sports 2. This is just a case, but I'll take it because I got some loose BS stuff. Gotcha. I'll probably get that because I know I don't have that. Cool. I'll probably get that one too. You want to get me for it? Uh, how much you asking? I don't know. I haven't looked anything up, so you're my buddy. Just give me some prepare what you would like to pay for it. Uh, you know I don't beat you up, so. For the old Game Boy? When you used to have to trade. Hmm. How much you asked for it? Uh, five. Five. We have now moved into day number two, Sunday, of this flea market hunt. on your games today? Oh, I'd like to get five dollars each, but I'm hoping to tag all ten of it. I might be interested in a few. Yep, that is a PS5 console. This would actually mark the first time I've ever seen one at the flea market. Green Lantern. Rich would probably love that. <laughs> first PS5 games. And how about that? I see a PS5 console at the, at the flea market for the first time, and now I see PS5 games at the flea market as well as well as some switch games including super smash brothers ultimate oh yeah What you ask on your games today? Um, it's just different prices on. Is it one? 
Just ten a piece. Uh, what about for Smash Ultimate? No, that one's twenty-five. Twenty-five. Yeah, and it's like in If I got these two, would you be willing to do 30 for both? Yeah, we can do that. Okay. Man, there just seems to be good games galore this weekend. Love to see it. Case in point, <laughs> looks like Bo and his brother have found a shit ton of PS1 games. I'm thirsty! I can't imagine what that is. I mean, no. Well, I'm probably 40 and 50. 40 and 50. How much was you asking on the Pac Man? Uh, I've got 15 on that. That's original. 15 on an Atari Pac Man? Uh, no thanks. That's kind of cool. Well, look at this. Here's a stack of PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2 RPG games. It's like 10.30, really. Richie Rich! What's up, Derek? How much? How you doing? <laughs> Philadelphia Star shirt, huh? Yeah, oh yeah. yeah that's that's your new team? Well, it's been my team, man. Oh, it's been your team. It's my team down here. 10 bucks for it. How to win a Nintendo <laughs> games. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah. yeah, there's been a lot of good stuff this weekend. Uh, yes, there's not much of... We need 360 games. It wasn't really anything spectacular, but it was cheap. Yeah. 
and but today has been pretty crazy. Yeah, Bo found, Bo and his friend found a bunch of PS1 stuff. Yeah, sort of. Like a bunch of, like him and his friend bought a bunch of PS1 games. I think one of them was like Pandemonium 2. It's going for like 50 right now. But I found some stuff myself, like like Lucario, Amiibo. I got that for three dollars. It's actually worth 16 online right now. Super Smash Brothers Ultimate on the Switch. That's a good one. My my first PS5 game. <laughs> there was actually a PS there was actually a PS5 out here for sale too. Uh, guy sold it for 500 with the box, which is I think right around where it's going for right now. I think that's right around where it's going for right now. Yeah. And then I found a couple of PS2 RPGs. Dragon Quest 8 and Rogue Galaxy. Yeah. Did you see these? So, yeah, the last two days have been pretty good. I don't know what he got. Yeah, but I don't know. It's hard to be fine. I'd love to just picture a Diane. Yeah, I'm going to get it altered. Oh, yeah. Shot Yeah. I'm going to start watching Canadian. They got Canadian over there. I'm going to start watching it, dude. Canadian football league? Yeah. Yeah, I've watched it from time to time. <laughs> Your stuff is pretty good too. I like uh, some of the different rules they got. Like you're gonna get a three-point conversion if you get, if you try to go from yeah. the ten-yard line. That's pretty cool. The CFL has like three downs. They said they're having a game tomorrow at like five o'clock or something. Like three, three downs and a longer field. <laughs> yeah. I like ten yards. <laughs> There's one of that one, black one is Prince. The original Kiss Me, you know, Kiss Me. Uh, I have them all already. So, if you want it, it's a good CD. It's a great CD, dude. The first one. That's the very first one. Yeah. Yeah, the one from 1970, whatever. Oh, too bad. This is good. Who made who? <laughs> Who made who? Who made you? Did I do it? Yeah. Didn't really have a song that like Yeah. I mean, I'm not a super huge Kiss fan, but there are some songs that I do like. That's something like that. Hey, Rich, have you ever wanted to be a Ninja Turtle? Just a couple, just a couple of sides right there if you wanted to. <laughs> We rap. Yeah, my son is a spider from Minecraft. This is like back in probably 480p if I'm lucky, you know? Yeah. <laughs> yep, yep. Good seeing you, man. <laughs> that's, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Where they have to. Game Traveler's case. That's pretty cool. PS3. Pretty cool. <laughs> N64. How, you doing? How much is this NBA Jam? Right. about this Rampage? I'm selling all the Xbox. I mean all the uh, Nintendo games together. Everything together. Really? Yeah, how much was you, How much was you asking? Rampage is probably the most expensive game over here, though. Really? Uh, 120 for everything. Really? Yeah, not happening. Because, number one, I really hate it when sellers try to do package deals when it's not really necessary to do package deals. Number two, that stuff ain't worth $120. I'm sorry. It's been a while. All right, you so? It's been a while. Yeah, this weather, this weather's been dicey, so I haven't been out really, honestly. You know, it's just been crazy. You know? 
Surely you can't be serious. <laughs> I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. Yeah. I just went to You ever see the TV show that they did? Like the six episode TV show? It's pretty good. I'm not actually. That's pretty funny, buddy. I just want to tell you. Good luck. We're all counting. <laughs> yeah, they already, they already landed and stuff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he comes in while they're in the middle of trying to land. Yeah. Oh, that's really funny. Here's the way I'm looking at it. You say the same thing. You say the same thing. I just did that. Great minds think alike. Great minds think alike. <laughs> cool. Let's check it out. I'm running the deal with the Alpha Blue Razor. Blue Razor, two of these. But yeah, that's what any I'm saying. Uh, any of these are a dollar a piece, or if you buy ten of them, you get them for five. There you go. So 50 cents a piece, and you go for ten. Can't beat that, man. I'm trying to thin them down, and then the guy that was set up next to me yesterday, he sold me a bunch, and I thought, I don't know why I'm not <laughs> trying to get rid of them. Trying to get rid of them, you ended up with more, huh? Well, he had a bad day, and I felt bad for him anyway, so I bought 200 DVDs from him yesterday. All right. Yeah, two of them. That's cool, man. Thanks, Shire. Zombie Land, the original one. Yeah, because yeah, I don't think I have this on Blu ray. I ended up with a, a Roomba, one of them vacuum cleaners. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> scared the hell out of my little Chihuahua, man. He was oh, man. So I took it back, and they wouldn't give me, uh, they wouldn't give me cash back. So I got a 4K uh, DVD player. I've only got two 4K movies, and I've watched them a million times to yeah. get that effect. <laughs> can't find 4K movies for under. There's your Green Lantern thing. Yeah, that's pretty cool. We appreciate that. Have fun. 
I will not have time to <laughs> oh, my car is right here. Alright, dude. Take your easy ride. You too. Good, huh? Well, here we are with day number three of Memorial Day weekend uh, special at the flea market. I don't know what the hell I'm going to find today after the last two days were just absolute awesomeness. So, I'm here early again, though. It's been a very, very busy weekend, to say the least. But, um, I don't know what else I'm going to find here. I mean, I don't know if it's, if it's tapped up for this weekend or not, but I guess we're going to go in and find out, so let's do it. Yeah, that Wii Play Motion for the Wii, don't really see it all that often. I think this is the first time I've ever seen this particular right. game at the flea market. Yeah, turn on your team stuff. Uh, they different prices on stuff, man. I got it wrote down, so I'm trying to get rid of them for my daughter. Uh, what you ask on that? This one, what is that? Wii Play Motion. Play Motion. She wanted 20 out of it, man. If you want it, man, I'll tell her I had to get rid of it for 15. It's, I mean, I know you go get stuff new, it's like ridiculous. It's like 50, 60 bucks on that motion, man. Yeah, even $15 is way too much for it, so I'm going to pass on it. As soon as he said different prices for all the games, I knew I wasn't going to be getting anything off this table, so it is what it is. Huh, more PS5 games. I'm going to say 15. 15. I'll go a little low if you are actually interested. Yeah, I was just curious. Like, it was new. I had to open it to make sure the disc was on. Yeah, the problem with that is once you open it up, it's no longer considered new. So, yeah, something to consider in the future. Between, what, 13 and 15? I think the best one was the decap one. Like, I think it was like a $20 one. And the, is that a good game? The, uh, I don't remember what that one was. I, I think it was like yeah. 11 12 $13, something like that. But if you're buying it for you... Yeah, because I don't it's think good. I have it yet. I bought a Superboy <laughs> online, a Super but Boy? the guy never shipped it, so I had to cancel it. So I was like, then I started looking for Super Nintendo. There was a Superboy out here yesterday. There was a Superboy out here? Yeah. I, I missed that. Yeah, he was. I don't know. He he also had, I think, like a retro, retro one and a retro two, and a retro duo. Out here? Mm -hmm. I missed that. You know what I did find yesterday? What? I got a box of games. They were a dollar piece. I paid forty dollars for about forty-five games. Most of them were like th Xbox 360 sports games, but it had uh, Pokemon Sapphire. <laughs> nice. I mean, there's. That's that's for my collection. Though. I'm like, I can't. I'm never gonna find that for a dollar. There's dollar PS3 games down there. I didn't see those. Well, that's it. Only bought uh, one game today, which, to be honest, probably not a bad thing. I was interested in that PS2, but I think the person would have wanted too much for it. And it was without an AV cable, so. But, I mean, when you look at the weekend overall, it's one hell of a weekend, to say the least. One hell of a Memorial Day weekend, to say the least. But let's go get some breakfast, go home, and see what the hell we got. Alright, well that's going to do it for a very successful Memorial Day hunt. And for the first time ever, we're doing a Spoils of the Hunt in my new recording studio. Yay! So, well, let me see if we get started. With the Spoils that I had. This week.
the first tip on the dock. There's WCW and WO Thunder. It has a THQ thing in it.
surprising. Nickelodeon Barnyard. This is not going to stay in there because the piece right there is broke. But it does have the game and the manual, so it is complete. You see, you got a new case for it. This is actually worth $13 right now, which is kind of surprising. Got left for $4. All told, it was worth about 23 total, so I saved 19 bucks on it. My first PS5 game, yes, PS5. Spider-Man Miles Morales Launch Edition. My first PS5 game. It is sealed. It hasn't even been opened. Got this for $10. It's actually with 25 seals, which is crazy. But that's not the big one. Here's another game that I'm probably going to be let's playing a lot on this channel. Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Got this one for 20 bucks. Got the game. Yeah, it's not gonna... This camera sucks. But got that for $20. It's actually worth $39.
PS2 RPG. First up, Rogue Galaxy on the PS2. Paid five bucks for it. It is complete. It's worth about 25 right now. And then lastly, I paid seven dollars for this one. Dragon Quest VIII: Journey of the Cursed King. Uh, the only downside is that it does not have a manual, but it does have the game. This game is actually going for about 30 right now. So, there you go. And that is all of the stuff that I got from my Memorial Weekend hunt. So, pretty good overall. Not the best of the year, but still lots of good stuff and lots of stuff that I can, um, that I can definitely do Let's Plays on. Especially the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Which I'm probably actually going to pop in and uh, give it a whirl and see what's going on. Which I think would be pretty cool. But uh, that's going to do it for this edition of uh, Flea Market Hunter. Thank you very much for watching. And until next time, this is the Packer Man signing out. See you later. What's happening ladies and germs? Thank you for watching tonight's video. If you're interested in sponsoring the channel, there is a link to my Patreon down in the description box below. Otherwise, hit like and subscribe if you want to continue watching great content like you saw today. Thank you very much for watching, and until next time, this is the Packer Man, signing out.